Are you tired of lag and stutters ruining your gaming? Well, if it's about sluggish RAM, it might be time to go from DDR4 to DDR5. But finding the right DDR5 RAM that balances everything isn't easy. After all, you want speed, low latency, and stability all at once. That's why today, we're looking into the top 5 best DDR5 RAMs that'll give you the edge you're missing. So, let's get started. First up, we've got the Kingston Fury Beast DDR5, a fantastic option if you're looking to get into DDR5 without spending big. With this RAM stick, you're looking at capacity options of 16GB or 32GB, which is pretty standard for gaming and creative tasks these days. It runs at speeds up to 4,800 megatransfers per second, though they did announce that faster versions are coming in the new year. For now, Kingston has combined the exciting speed with a CAS latency of CL38, which isn't much, but you'll still see a nice performance boost, especially if you're coming from DDR4. I mean, smoother multitasking and a decent bump in gaming speeds are all but guaranteed with the Fury Beast. Design-wise, it's got a sleek, low-profile heat spreader and comes in black. But the great thing about this budget DDR5 RAM is that it's compatible with both Intel and AMD setups, which is rare for the price point. And it supports Intel's XMP 3.0, which makes overclocking simple, even if you're not a tech whiz. I say that because you'll only need to make sure you enable XMP in your BIOS to get the most out of this RAM. But remember, while it supports overclocking, it may not have the same headroom as some pricier kits, potentially limiting performance gains for enthusiasts. Yet, for the price, it's still a solid DDR5 choice, I must say. At number 4, we've got the Crucial Pro DDR5. This one is a step up in performance, especially if you're serious about gaming and multitasking. It comes in 16GB and 32GB options, just like the Kingston, but this one runs at a speed of 5600 megatransfers per second. That's a noticeable jump in speed, and what it means is you're going to see faster load times and an overall smoother experience when using your PC. Now, the CS latency is CL46. That's a bit higher than the Kingston, and as I said before, lower is usually better. But even with the higher latency, the 5600 megatransfers per second speed often makes up for it, especially in real-world gaming performance. It's a pretty solid trade-off. This RAM is universally compatible with Intel 12th and 13th Gen CPUs, as well as AMD Ryzen 7000 series CPUs. So that's good news if you're looking for something that can fit in a wide variety of systems. And it can even downclock for systems that don't support the higher megatransfers per second. So it's pretty flexible. Aesthetically, the Crucial Pro is pretty minimalist. There's no flashy RGB here. It's all about functionality and no frills. That might be exactly what you're looking for if you prefer function over form. The price is reasonable for the performance it offers. If you're transitioning to DDR5, this is a good value. It gives you solid performance with reliable stability. Yet, here's something to consider. Some users have reported occasional RAM stick failures. It's not a widespread issue, but it's worth keeping in mind. And yes, the latency could be a bit better compared to some competitors, but that's part of the trade-off at this price point. So if you want dependable DDR5 RAM without the fancy lights, the Crucial Pro is a strong contender. Next, we have the Corsair Vengeance DDR5. Now, this is where we start getting into some really impressive high-end performance territory. The Vengeance series is already well-known among gamers. And with this one we have here, you've got options for up to 64GB in two 32GB kits, and speeds that can reach up to blazing fast 6600 megatransfers per second. You'll definitely see the difference in demanding games and applications, and it's excellent for future-proofing your rig. Plus, the CAS latency is just CL32, which means you're getting noticeably quicker response times. That's beneficial, particularly for gaming when every millisecond counts. Now, this RAM is optimized for Intel setups, but it still works with AMD. You might just need to do a bit of manual tweaking to get the best performance on non-Intel boards. When it comes to looks, the Vengeance DDR5 doesn't disappoint. It's got a sleek design, and you can customize the RGB lighting to match your setup and show off in style. Of course, this kind of performance and style comes at a price. It's in the mid to high range, but you're paying for quality. I mean, this RAM is built to last and to handle whatever you throw at it. That's why it's great for serious gamers and content creators. But the thing is, the higher price might not be for everyone. Also, there's a chance you might run into some compatibility hiccups with certain AMD motherboards. But if you can deal with all that, this one is a top contender with excellent scalability and speed. At number 2, we've got the Patriot Viper Xtreme 5, which is all about serious, I mean insanely serious speed. I say that because you're looking at speeds up to 8,000 megatransfers per second. 
So if you're into pushing your system to the absolute limit, this is the kind of RAM you'll want. You'll see exceptional performance in benchmarks and games, especially at those higher frequencies. The CAS latency is CL38, which might seem not low enough, but for such high speeds isn't bad at all. But the thing is, this RAM prioritizes speed and momentum before anything, and the results show when you put it through its paces. Now, the caveat is, this RAM requires specific motherboards to get full compatibility at those maximum speeds, ones like the Asus Apex. And that means you may need to do some extensive manual tuning on other boards to make it work right. So, it's not just a plug-and-play option for everyone. Aesthetically, it's got a unique design with RGB lighting and a robust heat spreader. The makers really wanted to make sure your setup looks as good as it performs. So, as you might guess, the price point is definitely higher end. It's best suited for extreme overclockers and high-performance users who want the absolute fastest RAM available. These will likely deter you if you're a casual user and not looking to check back on the system requirements. But if your system can handle it, the Patriot Viper Xtreme 5 is just the powerhouse you'll need. Finally, moving on to our number one pick, we have the G-Skill Trident Z5 RGB which comes in various configurations with capacities up to 128 gigabyte. That's a lot of RAM, giving you plenty of room for even the most demanding tasks. And you can find versions running up to 7200 mega transfers per second. It means you get incredibly strong performance in both gaming and productivity tasks. The CAS latency is CL40, which, while not the absolute lowest, is perfectly fine when you consider the overall performance and speed you get. This RAM is primarily designed for Intel systems, but also works really well with AMD platforms. And it's also highly rated among enthusiasts for its overclocking potential because of XMP profile support, which makes everything easy. That means you can get the most out of the RAM with just a few simple tweaks in your BIOS. Design-wise, the Trident Z5 is just stunning. It features RGB lighting with a sleek aluminum heat spreader design and comes in various attractive colors, allowing you to add some visual flair to your build. But all these means, the price point is also premium. You've got to spend top dollar to get your hand on this thing. However, that barely stops it from being a favorite among gamers who value both style and functionality. Then again, the higher cost might not be worth it for budget-conscious gamers. Also, the RGB lighting might not appeal to everyone. But if you're looking for A1 performance and want your rig to look incredible, the G-Skill Trident Z5 is definitely the way to go. Thanks for watching. If you want more videos like these, don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Also, press the bell icon for instant notification so that you never miss a video from Tech Insight.